time you send a WhatsApp message or use a chip and pin, the reality is it probably uses prime numbers. So imagine I'm sending a message to Blue Dot and the message is hello. The message hello is sent as the product multiplication of two prime numbers. So imagine hello is the number 15. Can you think of two prime numbers that make up 15? Five and three, yeah. And if, I, and if they sent me a message saying bye, and bye is 21, what two prime numbers make up 21? Seven and three, yeah. It's straightforward for small numbers. But with things like credit card, now, credit card information, what it does is it sends, instead of two small numbers, it picks the prime numbers about 20 digits long and multiplies this by something that's 20 digits long. And now the secret code essentially is like a really, really long digit number. And because we haven't quite worked out how to predict the pattern of prime numbers, for now, prime numbers are our best way of keeping modern data secure.